In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to get triple letter binds on console and on PC in two different ways with your keyboard and your mouse. So stay tuned. And before I start this video, make sure to like and subscribe and share this video with other people and make sure to put on post notifications to no get notified whenever I post. If your keyboard does not have a software that lets you bind key your keys to different things or different buttons, please put it down in the description. I will make a video on it. But if you're on console, it will not work. The only way that it will work on console is these two ways that I'll be showing you right now. For the first method, it will be with your mouse software where you're binding one of your mouse buttons to an edit bind. If you use an edit bind on your keyboard and an edit bind on your mouse, this will work. This will be very easy. All you have to do is download your mouse's gaming software to change the bind. All you have to do to do that is if you know the brand of your mouse, go to Google and look up either Logitech, Corsair. Personally, I have a Logitech G305, so I'll look up Logitech game software. Once I look that up, I see Logitech G Hub, which is the Logitech gaming software. I'll download it for Windows and I'll be able to customize my mouse's mouse buttons. Once you get that, all you have to do is click on your mouse, go to keys, and drag your keys on whichever edit bind that you use that you use to initially edit. You drag it on to the forward mouse button or the back mouse button, whichever one that you use. Personally, I use E to edit, so I'll be dragging E to my top mouse button. This method will add delay when you use it on PC, but on console, you really don't notice the delay, but there will be less delay on keyboard. So if you want to use this, if this is the only method that you can use to do it on PC, you should do it, but I personally do not recommend this at all, but it's what you want to use. After you're done dragging your edit bind onto your mouse button or whatever you use, all you have to do is go to the settings and put on onboard memory. On Corsair, I don't know what it is, or Razer, but if you can find this setting, it might be name different. Put it on. Once you put it on, there will be a profile. Put the profile that you put your triple edit binds on. And personally, mine is desktop. You click on that and then you save it. And it will save once you plug this out of your PC and put it into your console. It will ha you will have triple letter binds. For the next method, it has to do with your keyboard. You have to get your keyboard software. It's the same thing as your mouse software. Logitech uh, devices all use the same thing, which is a Logitech G Hub. I don't know about Corsair or Razer. I know, but I know they do have a software. I know that some Logitech keyboards do not allow you to get triple letter binds because they don't allow you to edit certain keys on your keyboard. And I know they only allow some, some I only, I know they only allow F1 keys and macro keys. So I'm sorry for you. But if you do want me to make a video on how to use a third party software to get triple up edit binds, I will do that. If you follow the same method as we did with the mouse and look up your keyboard with the software, it should show up. My keyboard, I personally can't do it because I have to go on YouTube and get a bunch of stuff. And because it's an RK61, it does not have a professional uh, keyboard software or well, it does but it technically doesn't let's say if I have a, ra a, a Razer keyboard now I'll look up a Razer keyboard software simple as that and, and I'll find it I don't know what it is because I don't have a key, key Razer keyboard and if you do know you know uh, all you have to do once you download your keyboard software you go to your keyboard software which this is mine and my keyboard is right here I go to whatever edibine personally I use E and then I'll go to mouse function and I'll go to key five or whatever it says for you and for your mouse button that you use or you can put it on the other key that you use when if you use two edit keybinds on your keyboard. On my keyboard it will automatically save to my keyboard and if I plug it into my console it will work. Also, using this on PC and using your keyboard software to use triple letter binds creates almost no delay. There is slight delay, but it is not as noticeable as when you use a mouse software to get triple letter binds on PC.